In a tearful conversation with his widowed mother, the Duke of Sussex assured grieving military families that they don't have to be sad to show how much they miss their loved ones. The Duke appeared emotional on screen as he chatted with Scotty Soldier's founder Nikki Scott, one of his prodigies, who told him about his experience telling two children their father had been killed in Afghanistan. Reflecting on his Oma, through the experience of loss, the death of her mother after she was 12, she sympathizes with the complex reality of grief, saying, You convince yourself that the person you lost wants you, or you have to be sad like maybe for the longest time. Prove to them that you miss them, but then there is this realization that no, they must want me to be happy about the importance of suppressing emotions in children, she added. I think that's the hardest thing, especially for kids, which is, I don't want this to talk, because it makes me sad. But when I realize that when I talk about it and celebrate their lives, it actually makes it easier. Duke is a global patron of a charity that supports bereaved military children and has pledged to do more to raise their children. Profile and funding to help it support more families. He filmed an 18-minute interview with Mrs. Scott, whose husband, Corporal Lee Scott, served in the 2nd Royal Armored Regiment and died in Afghanistan in 2009, leaving behind their then six-month-old baby Brooke, five. The prince attended a children's party supported by the soldiers of Scotty during May in the UK. The video shot at the time will now be released ahead of Defense Forces Day speaking with an American accent and saying, where do you want to start? And pronouncing Scotty Scotty. The prince fielded questions as Mrs. Scott spoke about her experiences, telling her children that their father had died and how he had set up a charity to help other families. No, I'm fine, she said, recounting how she broke the news to her five-year-old son. I literally changed his world. Wiping tears from her eyes, she added, I am. Sorry, I didn't think I would. The prince, looking teary-eyed, smiled and said, You think about everyone else too. About Scott's work, Prince Harry said, What do you think? Dunn is incredible. It's really inspiring. I'm very proud and privileged to now be a part of Scotty's and I'm really looking forward to doing everything I can to attract more people, more interest, raise more money, and get the message out, to that we can get more children the support they so urgently need.